They're here, the aliens. We only have one shot to defend the lab. We don't have lasers, we just have Lego bricks, a spike motor, and a spike essential hub to fight off this alien invasion. We're building a defense bot, powered by tension, aimed by hand, and programmed to survive. When the motor turns, it stretches a rubber band. The beam locks in place until, snap, the energy launches our ping pong ball straight into the invaders. We only had minutes before the next alien wave. I started building the first prototype, a simple catapult powered by a single motor and one strong rubber band. The hardest part of this build was coming up with a good platform for the ping pong ball to rest on before launching. With our launcher in place, I was ready to defend myself against the aliens. Direct hit! These aliens are coming in every direction. We're gonna to need to build something for 360 degree protection. In order to make this robot swivel and protect us in 360 degrees, we need to add an additional motor onto the bottom. We're moving all of my green pins and I'm gonna place this motor directly face down onto the build plate. On top of the motor, I can attach my ping pong ball launcher and it'll be able to swivel and protect us from the aliens. There's too many of them. I can't keep putting my head out there to reload after every single shot. We're gonna build a hopper, a way to automatically refill the ping pong balls without having to get out of cover. Here it is. This is going to let us drop in several ping pong balls all at once, and they'll fire one after another without having to leave the safety of cover. With a gravity-fed hopper, this robot can launch multiple ping-pong balls before reloading. We're not just building a robot. We're building a defense system for Earth. That worked almost too well, but I want to hear your ideas. What do you think we should add next? Be sure to like our video, subscribe to our channel to see more amazing builds, and let us know in the comments, how would you improve this defense system? Would you build it with a spike prime kit and add motion sensors or a color sensor? Could you add shields? What would make this build better? Drop us a comment and be sure to like. Whoa, that's a big alien. We did it, but who knows what's coming next. New invaders, new upgrades, definitely new robots. Be sure to like and subscribe to find out what great adventure we go on next. Thank you.